the Joe Rogan Experience. Train by day, Joe Rogan podcast by night, all day. Hi, Mr. Prime Minister. Nice to finally meet you. I'm glad you're on the podcast. Hey, Joe, it's great to be with you on here uh, on this Joe Rogan Experience. Well, let's get right into it. Why did you wear blackface three times? I did not wear blackface. But there's pictures of you wearing it? Those pictures are uh, fake, made with uh, Mid Journey or one of those uh, image apps. That's ridiculous. This technology was only just released last year. You wore blackface in what, the 80s, 90s? How can you know that? I'm sure the government has uh, been secretly uh, working with AI for uh, decades now. I said it before and uh, I'll say it again. I did not wear blackface. Look, I may be black on the inside, uh, but on the outside I'm 100% white. Uh, just like my father. Wasn't your father Hispanic, though? Do you really want to get into this? Yes, let's get into it. I've heard this rumor, uh, conspiracy, uh, whatever you want to call it, and it's 100% untrue and uh, unfounded. My father may have uh, been a socialist, but uh, he definitely wasn't communist. But what about those rumors of your mother, Mrs. Trudeau, sleeping around with all these uh, celebrities like Mick Jagger and apparently with Fidel? My mother uh, definitely got around, but she never slept with my father. Uh, I mean, Fidel, she was friendly with Fidel, uh, but yeah, not in the way your dirty mind is uh, thinking. And what do you think of the way you handled the trucker protest in Ottawa? Do you regret any of that? The truckers uh, were racists, Nazis, uh, white supremacists, uh, fascists, sexists, misogynists, transphobic, anti-science, and uh, racists. If I had my way, I would have uh, probably nuked the Capitol. Uh, to be honest. Nuked the Capitol? Are you out of your fucking mind? What do you think that would do to the rest of the planet? To mankind? Well, actually, uh, we prefer the term uh, humankind. So you're saying you would rather nuke the capital of Canada rather than compromise with these truckers and maybe relax your ridiculous COVID policies? You realize how retarded that sounds, right? Well, actually, uh, that term is... Uh, ableist. Can you stop dodging my fucking questions? Why did you implement these tyrannical COVID policies in the first place? At one point, people weren't even allowed to leave Canada. Is that correct? That's correct. We don't want the uh, unvaccinated to uh, spread their sickness to other parts of the world. That would be uh, not very uh, Canadian. But you do realize that the vaccine doesn't prevent transmission, right? So your policies don't make a whole lot of sense. Uh, the uh, vaccine has been thoroughly tested. Uh, it works, and uh, we have faith in the science behind it. Faith? Isn't science about facts and research and vigorous testing and experimentation, though? Faith sounds more like a religion. Look, Joe, I agreed to come on here to talk about uh, the good I've done for this country of mine, not to discuss uh, ridiculous conspiracy uh, theories and your racist ideologies. What? None of what you said makes sense. You are a blackface racist piece of shit, and this interview is over. Shortest and worst Joe Rogan experience ever. Goodbye, everybody. I shot that fucking balloon down.